The Dassault Rafale is a French April 5th generation, twin-engine, delta-wing multi-purpose fighter aircraft manufactured by Dassault Aviation. The Rafale is designed as both a land-based aircraft and a carrier. The Rafale aircraft program consists of three versions of the twin-engine multi-role fighter, the one-seat version of the Rafale C, the two-seater version of the Rafale B and the AL, carrier. Version is the Rafale M. The three versions of this fighter are equipped with engines, combat and navigation systems, aircraft management systems and flight control systems alike. They can all carry out all types of missions from ground attack to air superiority. The first production Rafale B-1 flew for the first time on December 4, 1998 and has been delivered to the French Air Force. The French government's current order of 61 aircraft was delivered from 1998 to 2005. The total order for France, the French Air Force and the French Navy is 294 aircraft. So, in this video we want to provide information about the cockpit of the Dassault Rafale aircraft. The Rafale features a delta wing combined with an integrated active canard to maximize maneuverability, plus 9 grams or minus 3 grams. While maintaining flight stability, a maximum value of 11 grams can be achieved in an emergency. The cockpit uses the Martin Baker Mark 16 F00 ejection seat, which is capable of use at zero speed and zero altitude. The seat tilts back 29 degrees to improve the G-force tolerance. The canopy hinges open to the right. This system is connected to the supplied oxygen generator integrated system to eliminate the need for multiple oxygen boxes. In the cockpit there is a head-up display, abbreviated HUD, wide-angle holographic. Two multi-purpose displays, multi-function display, abbreviated MFD, which duck down and are color flat panels. And a central collimated view. The pilot and display interaction makes use of touch, in this case the pilot wears silk lined leather gloves. Additionally, in full development, the pilot is equipped with a head mounted display, HMD for short, two rather unusual small touch screens below the left multi-purpose screen which are used to select various functions such as radio equipment. There is also a cloth to clean the screen. The pilot flies this aircraft with the side stick controller mounted on the right side and the shutoff valve on the right side. The Rafale's cockpit is also planned to include direct voice input, DVI, which allows the pilot to give commands using his voice. Finally, an oxygen generator, onboard oxygen generating system, abbreviated as a BOGS which functions to increase the oxygen content in the air taken in by the compressor motor so that it can be given directly to the pilot. With OBOGS, oxygen production is virtually unlimited. The autonomy of the aircraft is no longer limited by the delivery of oxygen to the pilot, which allows very long missions. It also facilitates logistics as it no longer requires the production of oxygen onshore, nor the loading and mounting of compressed bottles on board the carrier. Since the molecular sieve can be regenerated almost multiple times, logistics are simplified compared to the use of conventional oxygen bottles. Although not a true stealth aircraft, according to Dassault, the Rafale is capable of obscuring radar recognition. While most stealth design features are classified, the use of composite materials and the jagged pattern on the wing edges and canard trails serve to reduce radar scan ability.